everybody, this is my collectibles, and I got a quick video for you. These are the top five on the rise right now. This is February the 16th, 2024, and Vivi is really moving right now. The market is really surging, and there's some key ones right here you're going to want to look out for. And I'll give you some thoughts about why this is happening, and obviously talk about maybe one that's going to pump next. Of course, this is not any of this financial advice. This is just reacting to the market and obviously, this is really fascinating when this happens. Your vault value should be up quite a bit right now as people are really excited about what's going on. So if you do like the video, make sure you hit like. Let me know also if there's any that I missed right here in this video that you want to put in here that you own or that you've noticed have really risen up. These are just a few of the key ones, but I think they're really important. Let's zoom in a little bit closer right here. Let's get to this. Now, there's lots happening in the app right now. You notice that the MCP master collector points that people are going after has really risen the floors on the rare comics and all these kind of things cheap secret rares and stuff like that as people go after the points but in the last couple of days the grails have really started to move and it's really fascinating to see this happen now i don't own all of these i wish i did i own a couple of them but most of them i actually don't own i've wanted to get my hands on them i may have missed a window because you know, they're starting to rise up quite high. Number one, and these aren't in any particular necessarily order, but the partner statue has obviously really climbed up in the last few days here, up to 3275 on the floor. About a week ago, it was around 2300 or so, somewhere around that range, and he has really climbed up. I mean, part of it's the speculation behind the whole Disney Epic Games and all that kind of stuff. And then, of course, there's the speculation with Disney, how they're doing stuff with the blockchain, their patents and everything. I mean, it's really something what's going on with partners. But an interesting thing is that the golden moments themselves have all risen up, you know, specifically in the last 24 hours. It is nuts what's going on. So you keep your eyes on this. I don't know if it's going to go higher or what. But I mean, if you own a partner statue, I don't. And if you do. Or if you bought one when it went under 2000 at one point, congratulations, because I think it's just going to keep rising with what's going on in VV. Number two, the VV logo itself has also climbed up a ton. I mean, 6,500 now. We had some famous, you know, YouTubers buy one. You know, you can see that. And of course, other people who own it. We've had confirmed sales over the 5,000 range. So this one really is really solidifying again and moving up. I do not have this one as well. I wish I did, but man, oh man, is this one ever doing well with the utility pass from David Yu and all the kind of stuff, you know, at live events, it's only going to get stronger in my opinion, for sure. So if you do have one, make sure you hold on tight. That's just my opinion for sure. Number three is Todd Batman, the first ever NFT on VV. This one has risen up. It's 960 now. Currently, at this moment of the video, prices will change, obviously. But, you know, about a week ago, it was about 675 or so. And, you know, I mean, this is the interesting thing. You can see that these are like the top three type, you know, grail type items that people look at. And they're all rising up. People have turned their attention from MCP to like the high ticket items. Of course, there's Amazing Spider-Man, Seeker Rare, and the top Miles Morales, Seeker Rare as well, and others but the Todd has really performed well in the last day or two, like last couple of days, really, really awesome as well, right? And of course, Miles Morales. Now, this one is doing great as well. This is the ultra rare because the secret rare is so high. The ultra is up 22% in the past week. So, you know, you know that these are going to follow up as well, right? For sure. There's one I'm going to show you that I think should rise as well. That's right on the verge. That's coming up after my top five, but Man, oh man, you know, the big ones, the big, the big boys, the big, the big collectibles, they're all starting to move now in the last couple of days as people now focus on those, realizing we may be on the verge here of a really strong bull run for sure. Right now, number five is actually Darth Vader. He's actually gone up to 521 currently. He was under 400 a little while ago. And you can actually see this is an interesting point. This is this is my a point I'm going to make about what to look for next. You see that little poster down on the side right there? That one went up really high as well. It's at 109 right now. It was only 10 listed on it because it's so scarce, under 400 of those available. So popularity mixed with like, you know, scarcity and previous highs is what you should be looking for right now if you're interested in this because – you know, it seems that the grail type items or the big stuff is really starting to be focused on now after people have now solidified MCP. 
And they're going to continue to do both, in my opinion, as time goes on here. New drops are going to come, obviously, that have big implications. But this is what's going on right now. So what's next to rise? I have one in particular. I think Luke Skywalker Seeker Rare is going to rise up again as well. It's sitting at 1,000. This one hasn't moved like the other ones, but it's so scarce. You know, it's the floor is so thin. You can see that Ultra Rare sitting at 213 as well. This one's at 999 when I'm doing the video. So, I mean, this is another one. This is the kind of thing you look for, in my opinion, if you don't have one of these or if you're looking to like maybe list one, you may be listed a little bit above the floor. And then if a wave comes in and sweeps it, maybe you're one of the ones that gets swept, right? That's pretty awesome. Now, aside from the collectibles, I haven't shown any comics in this video. That's another story. We'll do another video on that as we look at the next couple of days. But it's really the collectibles that have really risen. But on the other side of things, the Omi itself. Omi itself, not the Omi, but Omi itself has risen up greatly. It is doing fantastic right now, sitting at 49% gains. You know, last 30 days, it's crazy. You can see this is just a seven day chart right here. It's up to 0 .0008, uh, 88. It may, we'll see how far it goes. I don't know if it's going to go up from here or keep going or down, but people are really focused on it. The reasons why are pretty simple. The MCP, the whole thing with the everything that's going on with the app. I mean, all the collectibles, Bitcoin's on the rise. There's a lot of factors here. It all kind of works together to get Omi up. And it's been doing fantastically right here. So, you know, we give away Omi on the channel. If you're a member, another 30,000 Omi went out to my members this past week with my Drophead NFT rewards. If you want to get it on those, join the channel, get a Drophead NFT for free. Get into my Omi rewards. We're already over a million given away and we're going to keep it going for sure. So now it's time for your thoughts, you guys. What do you think it's next to rise in the app? Do you own any of these? And uh, did I miss any? I know I did. There's lots that's actually risen. I mean, my most, the most impressive to me are the golden moments itself. And of course, the VV logo and Todd. These top three have been the most impressive. And uh, I think they're just going to continue to surge you know, people are going to take profits. So, you know, just make sure you're careful. You know, buying into pumps is never a good idea. You always want to make sure you're buying when it's low. If this is what you're trying to do, not financial advice. I'm just being a smart collector. But you guys let me know what you think as well and where we're going to go from here. And if we get another big ass drop, it's going to be so fun. <laughs> Specifically, you know, like a Wolverine or something like that. I know Venom's coming. I know all sorts of stuff is coming to the VV app. So, if you're watching this video for the first time, you're not fully aware of VV, make sure you download the app and get in because it's a ton of fun and a lot of stuff is really moving right now. I mean, in the whole crypto space as well. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you in the next one and happy collecting.